Good afternoon and welcome to this takeover day by the Concert Planning Module. My name is Stephen Moore and I'm in my third year studying trombone at the RWCMD. I hope you've enjoyed the performances seen earlier today. I know I certainly have. I have based my concert on classical music heard in the movies and I decided to choose this idea as along with a lot of other areas of society, the cinemas have taken a huge hit from this Covid pandemic. For the next half an hour or so, you'll hear a variety of music performed by a range of different groups, varying from a flute trio all the way up to a trombone octet. You will hear classical music used in films such as Brass Off, Mission Impossible and Apocalypse Now. I will introduce you to the groups and very talented performers throughout the concert. But first of all, I would like to introduce you to the Danube Quintet. The performers making up this wind quintet are Ewan Smith on the flute, Ella Pearson on the oboe, David Tillotson on the French horn, Madeline Stonehewer on the bassoon, and Meg Davis on the clarinet. They will be performing the very famous waltz by Austrian composer Johann Strauss, composed in 1866. The waltz has been used in many films, most notably Stanley Kubrick's 2001 hit film Space Odyssey. The sci-fi epic was based on Arthur C. Clarke's novel, which followed the character of Dr. Dave Bowman and other astronauts who were sent on a mysterious mission, when their ship's computer system, HAL, standing for Heuristically Programmed Algorithmic Computer, begins to display increasingly strange behaviour, leading up to a tense showdown between man and machine that results in a mind-bending trek through space and time. So here is the Danube Quintet performing Johann Strauss's Blue Danube, arranged by Bill Holcomb. Thank you. 
Next up we have Arion Trio who are a flute trio. Going from left to right we have Isabel Harris, Ewan Smith and Floki Pally. They will be performing Mozart's Marriage of Figaro. It is based on a French play by the name of The Mad Day or The Marriage of Figaro, written by Pierre Augustin Caron de Beaumarchais in 1778. It is the second play in the Figaro trilogy. The first play in the trilogy is The Barber of Seville, a work that was made into an opera on three occasions, though today we are most familiar with Rossini's 1816 version. The third play in the Figaro trilogy is The Guilty Mother. It was also made into an opera, but it is by far the least popular of the three plays. It was Mozart who proposed that he and Lorenzo de Pont, the librettist for Lenoz, use Beaumarchais' Le Mariage as the subject of an opera. 
It has been used in popular American comedy films such as Wedding Crushers, Runaway Bride, Trading Places and Zombieland. So here is Ariane Shield performing Mozart's Marriage of Figaro.
Next we have fourth base, a tuba quartet made up of second years. Going from left to right we have Henry Hart, Bradley Turpin, Matt Evans who arranged this piece and Tom Stone. They'll be performing O Danny Boy which again was using the comedy drama film Brass Off. Danny Boy is a popular ballad that was written in 1910. Many people associate the song with Ireland, even though lyricist Frederick Weatherly was a British lawyer. The connection came when his Irish-born sister-in-law sent him a copy of the tune London Derriere in 1913. So here is fourth bass playing Daddy Boy. Before we get on to our final piece, I'd like to say a big thank you to all those that performed. It has been very much appreciated, especially with the COVID guidelines and restrictions in place. I know it hasn't been easy. A very special thanks to Harry Archer and Robert Ball for the recording of this project, and I hope one day in the near future we'll get to perform in front of a live audience. The final piece features a trombone octet. Going from left to right, we have Ben Holford, Anna Louise Loy, Alice Hutton, Kieran Smith, Harry Archer, myself, Stephen Moore, Dylan Finley and Thomas Kilby. We are performing a symphonic synthesis from Richard Wagner's The Valkyrie. Perhaps the most recognised theme is the start of Act 3 of the opera. It is heard in the opera when the Valkyries, female messengers of the god Odin, ride into battle on their flying horses. This theme was also used in the 1979 American epic war film set during the Vietnam War, Apocalypse Now, as well as the very popular film franchise, Star Wars. Thank you once again for watching. Playing Us Out is a symphonic synthesis from Richard Wagner's The Valkyrie.